I'm Dan McFadden, Managing Director of Edelix. I'm here today to talk with you about Credentialate, our credential evidence platform. I'll first give you a brief overview for context and then dive right into a demo for you. At a time when arguably the value of a traditional degree or credential should be at an all-time high, there are a number of factors driving a perceived lack of value in such degrees. Companies globally are struggling to identify prospective employees with the requisite skills. Learners themselves are increasingly turning their focus and preference to skills-based training and non-degree alternative credentials. Partially in response to this, the use of micro-credentials and alternative credentials has exploded with nearly 1 million unique credentials being issued in the US. And the platforms and technology are enabling this at an incredible scale with more than one badge being issued, shared, or verified every single second. That all sounds fantastic and yet, we know that all learners are not the same, so why are there credentials? In the two examples that you see here, one recipient received a platinum teamwork badge and the other received a gold teamwork badge. The information on the micro-credential itself is all about the badge, nothing about the learner. So how do we fix that? With Credentialate. Credentialate adds meaning to micro-credentials by incorporating personalized quantitative and qualitative feedback into that micro-credential through our evidence page. What you see here in the two examples on the left, Samantha has received that platinum teamwork badge. But just as importantly, Credentialate has identified that she has fantastic skills at negotiation and conflict resolution. Whereas Lucy on the right received a gold teamwork badge, still very strong performance, but her greatest strength lies in fostering a collaborative team environment. So with Credentialate, these learners are able to surface their own individual and personalized skills and strengths as they've been assessed by an educational institution, bringing much more meaning to the learner as well as any prospective employers. How do we do this? Well, Credentialate, as a world's first credential evidence platform, harvests data from leading learning management systems, assessment platforms, and really wherever performance data for learners exists. We then run that data through a series of tools and models to ascertain who has demonstrated mastery of a particular skill or competency. We then integrate with leading badging providers to issue those micro-credentials with that personalized evidence attached to those credentials. We also link out to, uh, to skills databases such as MC's Open uh, MC Skills, which is a collection of more than 30,000 workplace relevant skills. By connecting the competency or skill as taught by the educational institution to this workplace skills, we're helping to, to build a common language across the board. And by having all of this information inside of Credentialate, we're able to provide a wide range of learning analytics and reporting visualizations to benefit the learner as well as the institution. Let's jump into the demo and show you some more. Let's start our demonstration inside of the learning management system where so much of this personal assessment data is captured and stored. In this case, we're looking at Canvas's SpeedGrader tool where an instructor is assessing their students against quantitative and qualitative criteria. Credentialate harvests that data from the learning management system. And we're then able to capture not only the structure of the rubric, but also associate one or more tiers of micro-credentials or badges based on learner performance. In addition to the rubric data, we also harvest learner performance data. Let's take a look at two different students. In the first example, Samantha here received a platinum badge for teamwork. Let's, when we look at the badge itself inside of Badger in this case, we learn all sorts of important information about the badge and the earning criteria. We use the standards-based evidence component to then view the attached and embedded Credentialate evidence page. Here we can see each of Samantha's strengths across these, these six key areas and how she has been assessed and really revealing her strengths on negotiation, responding to conflict and, and other areas. When we turn to other learners, such as Lucy here, who earned a gold micro-credential, when we look at that, the information inside the badge, again, describes that gold teamwork badge 
And then when we click on the embedded evidence, here we see Lucy's, Lucy's story, and where, while she performed strongly in a number of areas, her core strength is actually fostering constructive team climate. So just as Samantha and Lucy are very different individuals, so too should there be should their credentials and the attached evidence. In addition to the great value we provide to the learners, we also provide great insights and visualizations for the institutions themselves. Turning to some of these reports, the badge overview report demonstrates a view of how individual courses uh, have been assessing their, their learners. In this case, we'll look at, at the teamwork and drill down into a particular course where we can see the level of achievement at different levels, all the way down to the atomic level of looking at each of these ele elemental components that make up teamwork and the differences in performance across each of those elements. We can drill down further and look, in this case, at all of those who were issued gold badges in this particular course. For any of these learners, we can drill down even further. Let's take a further look at Lucy, where we can look at her detailed performance across all those criteria. We can see where she fell in that progression of badges. And we can even look at her relative performance in a histogram compared to the overall class performance at the overall level, even down to the individual elements. So we're providing a great deal of value and insight for the learners, as well as institutions, as well as employers or anyone else who's consuming and looking at these micro-credentials and the attached credential aid evidence. Thank you very much for your time. There's much more to show, but we'll end it there for now. Thank you.